Hey guys, I just left the Skywalker Hostel. I'm on my way to the airport. I'm going to get my ticket and head to China. Chaotic at the airport today. I'm at the domestic, of course. I always mess that up, going to international. I'm gonna make a little gripe here. After you go through security check and you're at the gates at Jeju International Airport, there's no Wi-Fi. I paid for Wi-Fi and it accepted my money and then it never connected to me to the internet. Check in, sit down, wait for the plane, get out. I actually finished the vlog, but I can't upload it because I can't get on the internet. I got my SIM card for my phone at the hotel. I feel so stupid. I have a Chinese SIM card. When I get to China, I won't be able to use it. Welcome to Shanghai. Hey, Leon. My friend Leon is here to pick me up from the airport. Hey, boss. How's it going? Good. Okay, so first things first, fix the phone, right? Yeah. Okay. We're gonna go to a place, remember my uh, iPhone I dropped on the ground? Toasted. Well, now we're gonna go to a uh, local local place? Local place, yeah. Yeah. He knows a guy. In, a, the, in the mobile market, you can make your own mobile. Make it from scratch? From, from just anything, you can make it. They can make it for you. A custom, custom mobile phone? Yeah. Interesting. Is he gonna come? Is he gonna sleep? You gonna sleep in there, Oscar? Or are you gonna come with us? You can too, Oscar. Oh, we're too busy. You can sleep, right? He had a rough night. Too much bijo. This guy's a party animal. I'm a little worried about tonight. I don't know if I'll survive. Hey. Yeah, it was it was falling apart, so I put the tape on it. Yeah, see. All the other is good. You need to unlock it. Yeah. You want to see how it's how it's the screen? Yeah, apparently it's pretty toasted. They're gonna have to replace the uh, the the two layers, right? So yeah. there's a, like the the glass layer, and then there's the under layer. The phone was trashed. He's calling around to try and find a, find a replacement. Okay, so they tried to replace the screen, but as I suspected, the actual case was bending in on the screen. It was probably gonna cause me more problems. So actually, we're gonna replace the casing and the screen. Basically, I'm gonna have a whole new phone for I think about $100, $105. Pretty good deal. Okay, so I have a, vir a virgin iPhone with old insides. You can tell it's you can tell it's new because it doesn't have any of the Apple things here. See, this is this is my old one. See, totally new. He just took it upstairs. He's actually going to print the uh, iPhone <laughs> made in made in America thing on the back. Bye bye. All right. We are good to go. I've got screen protectors on both phones. My old phone is now newer than my new phone. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty cool. And you come, it's made in USA. Actually. And it's made in the USA. It, it actually is printed on the back, made in USA. <laughs> now what, Leon? He wants to take me drinking. This, guy's, this guy parties hard. That's how I know I'm back in China. <laughs> e-bikes and e-bikes on top of e-bikes and e-bikes. Within an, a few hours of arriving back in China, I have had my screen and my back end of my iPhone replaced. That 
is what it means to be in China again. If you guys don't know Leon, Leon and I climbed mountains together. He's uh, due to climb Everest. He's looking into that as well. And uh, we climbed a mountain near Pakistan called Mushtaga. Uh, and uh, yeah, we've been good buddies. He's a good guy. He gives me a run for my money. So this is pretty good milk tea? Yeah. The best in town. Hi. Hello. Okay, so where are we going now? Jinshan. Jinshan. Yeah, Baijiu. Well, Hongju. Uh, mm. <laughs> Fish. Food. It's seaside, right? Yeah. It's near the water. Yeah. What's the dark? Um, Lulu. 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 This is Lulu. Hello, Lulu. Sits. <laughs> All right, this is the kind of restaurant I'm normally used to. Chinese style. Chinese restaurants are a little bit dirtier than Korean restaurants. A little bit more grungy. Okay, this has the potential to be an extremely rough night. I've got to stay strong and resist the white and yellow wine. They're destroyers if you let them take hold. <laughs> it's, the, it's the after the drink that's even worse than the drinking. <laughs> See guys, this, this is Zimbaijo. This has been the cause of many horrible, horrible, horrible mornings in my life. And apparently he's got so much meat on his bones that it doesn't affect him. <laughs> but this guy over here, he's, he's having a rough time. In China, if you want to make contract, drink this. I don't want to make contracts. Jaiyu. Jaiyu. Add fuel. Can we? first came to China, I felt obligated to drink, and I would drink way more than I should have. I would have some really rough days and some equally rough mornings. I have built up a resistance to the coercion uh, for drinking, and I'm able to kind of like, no, 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 and end up not being completely blasted by the end of the night. So we're in uh, Jinshan. It's the southernmost village in Shanghai. The first fishing village in Shanghai. And it's kind of been a revamped area. Do you guys remember the scene in Mission Impossible 3? Where Tom Cruise was running along the, uh, 
the canals in this Chinese city. Well, this was the Chinese city that he was running along at the grand finale of Mission Impossible 3. All right, guys, it looks like the night is gonna go on a little bit longer, but I'm gonna end the vlog for today. Like, subscribe, share, comment, and uh... <laughs> 加油! <laughs> 加油! <laughs>